Meet father and daughter duo, Corey and Corey. After recently moving from Ohio to Florida, they are eager to settle down and build their dream home. Big Corey wants to give his daughter a forever home as quickly as possible. Today we're in Apollo Beach, which is a really cool community. Apollo Beach is a master plan community with canals literally in the backyard that lead right out to the open bay. So it's like a boater's, fisherman's paradise. They'll get dolphin and manatee right in their backyard, and they definitely did not have that in Ohio. The lot is almost a quarter acre, so it really offers a lot of space they can have. Let's kind of get a lay of the land and figure out what you're wanting here. I would love to have a nice yard all the way around. How many bedrooms? It's just the two of us, but I'd like four to five. We have family that's gonna come down, and so we need space for that. What are we thinking, two or three baths? At least three. I love entertaining, so definitely a big kitchen, but more importantly, ah. barbecue is my thing, so. I don't expect you guys to know exactly everything you want in the home. That's why we're gonna do inspiration tours. This home has a Florida Beach Cottage vibe going on. I love the style. Something makes you feel like you step out the door and you're already at the beach. Do I get a rocking chair? That's pretty easy. I think I can yeah. handle that. Do you want a porch? This porch is amazing. I really want a wraparound porch. All right. And I definitely like that it's got a metal roof. Okay. It's, it's a very interesting look to me. Let's talk about the layout. Are you thinking that this floor plan works for you? I would prefer walking in and just being able to go wherever I want. There is a lot of counter space in this kitchen. There's definitely a lot of counter space, and that's definitely needed. I like to cook. I like to cook for lots of people. Okay, master bedroom. I like the lighting they got here. Yeah, it adds drama and visual impact. I love the color of this Of course walls. you do. I just like it because it's like really bright and it's not like dull, like his colors. I don't know about the walls, but these countertops I like. The colors are great and I think they would go great with gold. The Corys have not been seeing eye to eye when it comes to color palettes, so it's my job to find the middle ground so they're both happy at the end of the day. So it's gonna have that beach vibe, basically uh, the opposite of Ohio. Since we've got this corner lot, we really wanted to do a corner wraparound porch. Right from the entry, you're gonna be welcomed by a foyer. You're gonna be able to see all of your living space. And we know how much you love to cook, so this kitchen's gonna be state of the art. Huh? I like that, yes, absolutely. All right, it's official. Deal. <laughs> we'll Looking see forward to it, guys. Bye. Bye. Thank Bye. You. Today's day one, it is go time. So far, the lot scraping is going well. However, that dumpster is clearly in the way. Not the best spot for it because it's right on the Corey's property line and we've got to get this thing moved in order to dig the footers. Any small hiccup can cost us time and money. Thank goodness we got this dumpster moved. Now the excavator can move in and do its thing. I know it doesn't look like much now, but we're moving along here super nicely, but we still got a long way to go. Brian, I think I got a, a real issue here, man. Framers won't be able to do anything with the trusses if that's not fixed. We have to fix this now. Uh, so the trusses are supposed to be installed tomorrow. The problem is we are two rows too high with our cinder block. So we've got to painstakingly knock each one of those cinder blocks out to get it level. Otherwise, these trusses are not going to fit flush. They're going to be crooked. These houses are like puzzles going together. And if one piece is off, the other piece is going to be off too. All right, let's start knocking out some block. Yeah. We got a lot of catching up to do tomorrow. Today I'm meeting with the Corys at a showroom so that we can hopefully make some design decisions. It's time to get down to the nitty gritty and focus on specific design elements for the Corys dream home. I feel like we're really close. You're fun. I wanted to make sure we threw some fun in. So check out this tile for your bathroom. You like that blue and white? I like that. But there's also, these are both fun. Yeah, I, like I like this, this one, one better good. though. Oh my goodness, blue everywhere. I'm gonna start placing some orders because we gotta get this thing going. Corey and Corey's Apollo Beach bungalow starting to take shape here. Framing is completely done. We got the metal roofing going on. We're putting windows and doors in. This front door will be the first one to go in and it'll be the entryway to their dream home. Perfect. The house is coming along incredible. We passed our plumbing and electrical inspections, which mean we're able to get this house insulated and get all the walls closed in. Now we're sealing up the drywall and starting to paint. The tray ceilings that Big Cory wanted look great and are adding drama and definition to the spaces. This is one awesome dream home. Kitchen cabinets finally arrived after waiting for them for, gosh, almost a day. Had to work throughout the entire weekend to get this done because if we didn't, everything else would be a domino effect being delayed. So flooring's being prepped. That's gonna go down today. We're gonna be able to build our templates for the countertops, get all those measured, meaning the backsplash can go in, appliances can go in. So. Pretty soon, Corey and Corey are being able to call this their dream home, and I cannot wait to see their faces when they walk through that door. It's looking awesome out here. I get excited when it's landscape day. 
This is how we get it done in 100 days or less. So we literally have irrigation going on right now, being trenched. We've got our big palms going in. Our small plants just arrived. Sod's going down later on this afternoon. A typical build, this is like a four or five day process. We're gonna knock it out in one. So design's going on on the inside. We got design going on on the outside too. So much going on, the big trees are in, the small plants are about to go in. Sod's starting to get laid down. Whew. So we got about four hours left in the day, so we have a lot to get done. But uh, before sunset hits, this whole house will be landscaped. Another day, another delay. So uh, the countertops for the Corys were supposed to be here hours ago, and uh, they still have not shown up. So we're waiting again. Dream homes aren't built in 100 days if materials don't get delivered on time. Ooh, they're here. Get your hand up. That's beautiful. <laughs> I like what I see. It almost looks like the ocean. Like a little wave. I love it. It ties in perfect. See, now the kitchen's starting to feel like a kitchen. It's look good. We're cruising along with the finishing touches, which means the hardware is going on the kitchen cabinets. The bathroom tiles are getting installed. We are painting the Corey sign for her room, and that outdoor grill for our special project is finally getting assembled. Wow, this, this is gonna look incredible. We've got two special projects for the Corys. We've got the outdoor kitchen for Big Corey and this cool indoor play space for Little Corey. Just start passing me the rungs, and I'm okay. gonna get these in here. All right, this is gonna be cool. She's gonna love this. It's furnishing day, and the Corys have a contemporary glam style. But all the blues and metals can make it feel really cold. So we're warming it up with some neutral warm pieces to round off that Apollo Beach bungalow style. We've got some final installs to do in the bathroom. Lighting is getting installed. And Sarah from my design team and I are gonna deck out little Corey's room. The day is finally here. Today the Corys get to come home. Oh yeah. Squeaky clean. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, let's do this. We finished this thing in 98 days, two days early. You got butterflies? Yeah. So do I. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear my heart. Corey's! Woo! This is amazing. That's our house? <laughs> oh Woo! my god. Dad, we have rocking chairs. Oh, you noticed rocking the rocking chairs. chairs. Can I go try them out now? Oh, for sure. I guess so. Ready? Go for it. Oh, thanks, she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> no more stoop, you guys. I love them. The whole theme for this house was the Apollo Beach bungalow. What do you think when you look at it? Is that the vibe you get? That is yeah. the vibe I get, yes. A little Absolutely. different than the homes that you see up in Ohio? Yes. Drastically different. <laughs> yeah. You guys ready to check out your dream home? Yes, we are. After you. <laughs> oh my god, what? Oh my god, what? Those ceilings are beautiful. Let me show you the rest of your house. Your Look speeches. at the backsplash. It's blue. <laughs> you got blue in my kitchen and I'm not even mad. Yes! <laughs> Dad, look at the counters. You have got to be kidding me right now. <laughs> no, we're not. They look at the living room? Yeah. yeah, check out the living room here. It's just amazing. <laughs> so walk through that door and check this out. <laughs> oh, man. Yes. <laughs> I like that you made that wall blue. Do you really? I do, I do. It wouldn't be right any other color. It really See, I told you blue just makes everything better. Do you want me to check out the bathroom? Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Dad, look at your floor. Oh, look at this tub. <laughs> this is perfect. So, Cora Jr., how do you think your bathroom is going to compare to your dad's bathroom? <laughs> I love this floor. Is that what you envisioned? <laughs> yes. Look how big your shower is. It makes me happy. All right, that's all that counts. Are you ready to see your bedroom? Yes. Ooh. This is amazing. What do you think about the blue polka dots on the wall? I really love it. We may have another surprise for you. Get in there. No. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is this cool or what? Yes. That's awesome. We really wanted to make sure you had your own space to relax, unwind, hang out with your friends, be the teenager that you are. Aww. I love this. I really love that room. That's my favorite room. So we've already surprised Corey Jr. with something, Corey Sr. We want to surprise you with something. Let's okay. head out to your back porch. Now this is a party. <laughs> now this is a party. This is a party, right? For sure. <laughs> 
Yes. This is where the magic happens. Yep. We knew how much you love to cook. We wanted to give you something outside where you can cook out in this beautiful weather year round. I'm at a loss for words. It's amazing. That's that's the only word I can use. It's amazing. You deserve it. We yeah, appreciate you raising such a beautiful daughter. You're a very lucky girl, little Corey. I'm a lucky father. Yes. <laughs> 98 days ago, it was just a dirt lot. And I remember standing here talking about what the house was going to look like. And now, it's exactly what we thought it would look like. It's beyond what I thought it would look like.